More greens, more beans, more nuts and seeds is what I'm advocating here. And that dramatically lowers the glycemic effect of anyone's diet because those foods are very low glycemic. The more you eat greens, beans, and nuts and seeds, means the less you eat the rice and potato, the lower the glycemic diet, the glycemic load of your diet drops tremendously. You following this? If, you've di if your diabetic load drops tremendously, then diabetes reverses itself. And what do we see? 90% of diabetics becoming non-diabetic. The average blood pressure in the study dropped, to, dropped by 27 points. The same amount of blood pressure lowering as the big study with 445 people with blood pressure medications. Did you follow that? Same amount of blood pressure lowering in a diabetic study, even though it wasn't a study on blood pressure lowering. It's a study where people reversed their diabetic, and we saw, and we saw 9 out of 10 people get off their diabetic medications and become non-diabetic. Mean hemoglobin A1C went from 8.2 to 5.8, which is in the normal range, and people didn't eat medication anymore. If they go back, sure, are they, are they diabetic anymore? Well, that's a semantical argument. If they go back gain weight again, they go back to eating bad food, they become diabetic again. Yeah, but, they were, but a healthy enough diet was able them to have normal blood sugar without being needing medication. So literally, they're non-diabetic. Is an overweight person overweight anymore? If they lose the weight, well, they're not overweight anymore, but they're not obese anymore. But if they go back to eating the same diet, they're going to be still be overweight. They're going to go back to being overweight again. We have to argue about this. Whether it's a... Here's a guy. And pardon, the slide says 2014. I'm sorry, it's 2016. So he's actually 95 years old now. Here's a guy who came to me in his 70s with triple vessel disease, where his cardiologist tells him that he needs to have angioplasty urgently or he's going to die. I said, you're not going to die. You're stable. Give me three months of your life, and I'll send you back to the cardiologist so much better that he'll say you don't even need the procedure anymore. So he, I, I made him promise he would do what I tell him for three months. He got, total, he got better. He went back to his cardiologist, and the cardiologist said to him, I've never seen a person reverse their heart disease before like this. The stress test normalizes. His blood pressure is normal now. He's not on medication anymore, right? But the cardiologist was made. I said, you're a cardiologist. You, all you see is thousands of people with heart disease. You've never seen one get better. All I see is people who get better. Maybe you should change the way you practice a little bit. <laughs> but that's not why I'm telling you this. The reason I'm bringing John Pawlikowski, and he gave me permission, he gives me permission to use his real, his real name in his case, but the reason I'm giving you this information and telling you this case is because he's still thriving now in his mid-90s, chopping wood and doing, and you know, being physically fit. He's better shaped now than he was in his 70s without heart disease. And every year he got older, his blood pressure actually in year two and year three and year four, his blood pressure on no medication got a little better and better and better the longer he did the program. What I'm point I'm making to you right now is that aging didn't create the disease. It's, it's like water runs off a waterfall and hits a rock and after... 20 years, the rock breaks in two, but the rock didn't age. The water hit day after day. It's the American diet lays its effects on your body day after day. You, 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 you age prematurely, and you age your blood vessels, and you create these diseases because you do the wrong thing over and over and over again. You do the right thing over and over and over again, it goes the other direction, no matter what age you are.